Hello everybody, so great to see you today. Here I am visiting my sister in beautiful Colorado and we took this three hour drive and how well worth it it was coming to this Rifle Gap State Park. They had beautiful three waterfalls and I found this quiet place where they had this bulk of water and the beautiful trees in the background. Isn't it just gorgeous? You know, we were planning to come on the sister bonding trip getaway. And prior to this, I found out both my sister and I, wow, we have been so incredibly busy in our lives coming up to this point. We planned to get together four months ago and we planned to take a wonderful first time ever RV trip, just the two of us and stay a few nights over here at Rifle Gap State Park here in Colorado. But you know what? Life happens. And when I came to visit her, she had a little bit of issues with her RV. So we were not able to take the RV here, but we made this one day trip and it was so well worth, worth it. I encourage you in this video, in the midst of you are so busy, incredibly busy in your life, and you have many hats to put on, please let us consider to take a moment of pause and enjoy. Enjoy your everyday life, but especially enjoy your relationship with our Heavenly Father God, for He misses us, you know? So many other things can grab our attention up front and certain things it just seems so urgent that nobody else can take care of. And we can be so busy with work or family or life or whatever things we're involved with. And we don't have that time to just pause. Well, I just came from those three waterfalls and wow, times of refreshing. The roaring sound of the crashing of the waters, it was thunderous. And it was so refreshing and magnificent. And all the water splattered in my face. I thought of making a video for all of you over there, but it would have been too loud and I'm sure you couldn't hear my voice. So I came to this calm place here and it's just so beautiful. So in relationship with God is reciprocal. Whenever we're in relationship with people, it cannot just be one-sided. And God, he wants to, for all of us to enjoy him as well as he delights and enjoy all of us, his children. So let us just take this moment, if it's needed for all of you, to just enjoy God, enjoy the moment. Instead of having so many plans and business in our lives and to-do lists and future-minded thinking, let us enjoy this each and every day and enjoy this beautiful, abundant life that God has given to each and every one of us. You know, it says in John 10, 10, that the enemy, he comes to steal, kill, and to destroy us. And he knows us pretty well. And he knows what can grab our attention and just pull us away from our attention to our Heavenly Father God. Some of us may have idols before God. Maybe we ourselves, we are in control. We want to control everything in our life and we can become like a God. But again, I am here to remind you, allow God, our Heavenly Father, to be our sovereign Lord and Savior in our lives and let Him let go of the reins and let Him have control in our life and just to be in pure enjoyment in that wonderful relationship, reciprocal relationship that it takes two of us to enjoy it to the fullest. For again, the enemy comes to steal, kill, and to destroy. But Jesus says, I have come to give you life and to have it abundantly. So enjoy each and every day to the fullest abundantly. And let us just take a pause and relax. Take that time to enjoy. This trip was so timely for me personally. Some of you may have known I've been having trouble with lifting my arm. I believe I have a rotator cuff tendonitis. 
and it's been going on for over three weeks now. And wow, it has just been a nuisance pretty much to work or to do anything. And I just been so constantly busy with many variety of things that this break was so timely and so needed. And also my sister too, she has been extremely beyond busy. So we thought maybe the RV trip wasn't in the plans. God knows us so much more better than we do because going on the RV, it would have taken more time, preparation, mentally and physically just to get, get the food and groceries and get everything ready for the trip. No, we just are relaxing this one day trip and just enjoying each other's company as sisters and we get to enjoy the nature, this beautiful nature that God has given to us. Isn't it just glorious? So I hope that this video, if anything, you're just enjoying this nature and the beauty of God's creation and I'm enjoying this r, &R time rest and relaxation let us enjoy life to the fullest again jesus came to give us an abundant life and let us take it on and just embrace it and relish and enjoying god and in the heavenly father relationship with him god bless you and i'll see you next time goodbye